could I have used today's video, which releases a day before the Barbie movie, to capitalise on Barbie? Maybe, but I don't earn money off YouTube and 50% of my content is already Barbies, so I can lay off it. I thought about it, like what Barbie related content can you make when you currently have £8 in your bank account? Not much, so here's a sketchbook tour. This is the sketchbook that ended the 2019 sketchbook tour, and it has some old things, like old Dodie Fanner, old Orica, and then I finished it, and then I start, and it's early 2020, pre-pandemic. We're drawing D&D, we're drawing dress designs, we're drawing my monologue from GCSE drama, we're drawing drag queens, we're drawing Orca's old wife, again, doesn't exist anymore, love Tai Tai, that is my OC Tai Tai. I'm going so fast, I think that's Regina George, those are my old Holmes High characters, that was Gigi Good, and Penny and Amaris, Yara, all those C's, drag queens, chamomile, my family is Animal Crossing characters, whatever the heck that is, Bob the drag queen, Jamie the musical, drag queens, I don't know what that is, Monster High characters, uh, Titania, Velma, that was Tucker, that was a YouTube video, that was Cat, Drag Queens, Outfits, Twitch Motes, done. Really struggled closing that sketchbook. I've edited out some parts for your own good. Let's look at some OCs, some costume work, some friends, some- don't look at that. Some drag, some fan art, there's, you know, I had a Minecraft youth phase in early 2020, I'm so sorry. Dungeons and Dragons. Balloons from Special Girl. I never did anything with that character, and more OCs and Bo Burnham jump scare. And then we finished that sketchbook. There's a lot more drag queen and dungeon than dragons art in this one, including self-portraits and old art redraws and... You know, I can't escape the Minecraft YouTuber thing, I'm sorry. But I mean, there's Dodie and there's Gwendolyn, obviously my favourite, and Dodie again. Drag queens and Kara exorcism. Sandra, Trixie Mattel, love drawing, Tim Burton, Beauty and the Beast, old OCs again. Uh, more Dungeons and Dragons. I love couples. Um, I'm single, painfully. Deborah, and then Dungeons and Dragons again. It's like that's all I am. I am Dungeons and I am drag queens. Speaking of, found up for that show is in the last sketchbook. But yeah, it's literally it's just Dungeons and Dragons and then drag queens and Dungeons and Dragons again and then human versions of my Dungeons and Dragons characters, self portraits, dizzy fan art. Uh, then what was coming up? Eric, you should you like that one? And that was for the black suits. It's a really good musical. You should listen to the black suits. It's a, it's a good. At one point, I tried redesigning the bun, and then I went back to Fan. I don't know who that is. I don't know what that is. A lot of Orica and Gwendolyn. Even though the only characters I've ever played have been Gwendolyn and Sandra, and I don't draw Sandra that often. You know what's coming up? My tattoo D and D characters, Keytris and Calliope. I love them. I love their tattoos, and I love Dungeons and Dragons characters. We're done with that one, and now we're starting a different sketchbook. This is different. It's not ringbound. It's fancy. That one over there is Ilarion. That's a Barbie drawing, you guys wanted Barbie, right? I think the only OC that survived from my Ever After High days is Tai Tai, and so I'm glad that she's going strong. There's a lot of Keytris and a lot of Gwendolyn and a lot of Orca, and I really neglect Sandra and Althea, and I have favourites, I'm sorry. I miss d and I love Vecna's boys, I miss them so much. Here's some more fan art and random OCs and Orca's facial expressions. Ooh, the Monster High. Do you know how difficult it is to record a voiceover over a time lapse? You want to like, point everything out, but you can't, so it's just like, trust me, I have stories behind these things, it's just I can't be bothered to make that long of a video. But after this sketchbook is the last sketchbook, the one I completed very recently, and it begins with art that I stuck in because for a time I didn't have a sketchbook. There's a lot of um, my Dungeons and Dragons characters I didn't know when I drew that one because I didn't date it. Date your artwork, gang. There's a lot of unfinished artwork in this sketchbook as well, including, ooh, portfolio work for when I applied to university because I'm going to university for costume in September. That's a life update. I am very proud of you, so hi if you're my uni but watching this, uh, thanks. That's art by my dog. And then there was a period of time where I drew all of my D&D characters' families because tragic backstories are really fun when you can connect faces to the trauma. One reoccurring face you may see is Marta, she's my monster high OC. Unfinished drawings are a lot in here, and the monster high designs that I was talking about. If you're wondering what I colour with, I literally use pelican paints that I had from my time in primary school. Also, Bard Bee for your Barbie content. That's Dungeons and Drag Queens. That's Sordia. And that's Orica. And that's it. I'm an Orange Bunny. And what should I christen the sketchbook with?